What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Always Occupied Home and Product Reviews. Right now, we have a, a product that we had before, but this time it is Turf Type Tall Fescue. So, long story short, I used uh, the Greenview Sun and Shade last year. Unfortunately, I was getting ODD and weeds was growing inside, and I sprayed specticide on my new grass and it killed all of my new grass but this is going to be a different story this year and this brand works pretty good i will do day by day uh clips of this stuff growing anyways so i'm going to put it on this side of my yard right here we are going to man manually tamp it in because i don't have my tamper so i'll just stomp it in you can also check this out for yourself you may want this this bag is 750 square foot and I think I got it for 12 bucks. One of my favorite tools of the year is this blade and scraper Kaban. Got it from Lowe's, did a review on it. I'll put a link in the description on that. And be on the lookout because I'm going to get another hand spreader, but the next one will be either a Ryobi or a Scotch brand hand spreader. Okay, you guys, so yeah, I did go a little ham on it, you know, if you don't know what that means. Yes, I did, a, uh, I put a lot of seeds in it because one, it's a new lawn, and two, I don't really have no settings on this bag on, you know, new lawns or whatever. So right here it says new lawns, and it says loosen the top two to three inches of soil. Other than that is remove debris, sticks, and that's all that is blah, blah, blah stuff, stuff that you should already do. But as far as um, your spreader settings, there is no spreader settings on here. Let's see how this stuff comes out. I'm ready to tamp it down with my feet and then that will be it. All right, you guys, I tamped it down. Now I'm going to take photos, maybe like weekly or maybe like every other couple of days or whatever. So y'all can see the results like I did on my last video. If you want to know, this stuff is not coated. That's how it looks. I'm about to show y'all that green view grass is coming up. The tall fescue mixed with the sun and shade. It's only been uh, maybe like four days. It haven't even been a total week yet. This Greenview brand is pretty good. So I may be sticking with them for a little while. This is May 9th. And I started this project at uh, April 25th, I think. Oh, look at that. What's up, little guy? <laughs> Anyways, you can see it like that, but if you look down, it's getting taller. So this is May 9th, guys. Today is May 19th, and it grew approximately about inch and a half to two inches in height. I will even bring y'all closer. I gotta take y'all off real quick. We're down here in the grass, and as you can see, even one of the tallest ones is about three inches in height, but it's about two inches all the way through. This seed is pretty good. That's it with the green view. I don't know what they put in it, but this is a good brand, and I will overseed with this seed this coming fall. It is June 26. I did the first cut last week on this grass and it's growing back pretty good. And it's looking pretty good. We have some little 
little bit of weeds, but we'll take care of that next year because they will die off once the cool temperatures come back. But if you look, it covered pretty, pretty well. Yep. And that's about it, you guys. So this product is pretty good. That's about it. If you want to know anything else about this product, let me know. 